Hi everyone. Uh, welcome back to the second lessons of the Chinatown Surface Center Whitehead. Okay, so this I know the first lesson is really boring, but talk about the uh, general general rules about the vita, it would be uh, really basic. So, but basic, but is really really important. So right now the second class, hopefully you don't feel bored. So, uh, right now the second class is talk about how to use link and learn. Okay, what is Link and Learn? Link and Learn is the website that helps you to get IRS certificate for VITA program each year. It was the source uh, called Practice Lab that teach you how to foreign text and how to use tax layer for prepare tax return. The exam area is use is using the publication 5101 4491 4012 and 6744 on the year you volunteer so the website is down there is http as colon slash slash www.linklearn C E R T I F I C A T I O N dot C O M slash D slash. Okay. And basically, our exam will be go to the uh, link and learn to get it. So, to uh, all the material are based on the publication. What does they teach? what will the exam will be part of the question is about those four material actually it's free material because 6744 is the exam question everything is inside if you want to practice by the question they will be asking in the exam study 6744 and the basic information is coming from publication 5101, publication 4491, and publication 412. And uh, right now, this one is the main page of the link and learn. So, uh, on your this way, you will see two, and this way, you will see one. Hopefully, I did not get it wrong for left and right, just you see one and two. Okay, so one is practice lab, second is the uh, place you click for create account for your certification right now just start from the practice lab after you click the practice lab and then it will be become this uh, page these pages on the enter password you enter capital t r a i n p r o w e b train for web after you click this password and then click the login button next to it and the next page will be this one if you have the account in this page you can start to log in if you are not so you need to click the create account to create a practice lab account so in this page, we start to type your email address, username and password for practice lab. Email, confirm email address, username, password and confirm password. But in the program type, it would be WITA. Uh, for the SIDN number is capital S, seven, 
zero zero one zero four two five seven hundred ten thirty two five. So, uh, for the security question, it's just for you when you forget the password. You could be using this security question to uh let you to memorize your password or get your password through your email. Okay, please whatever you uh set the question and the answer please mark it down and remember it and then click create account to register after you create account uh you just go back to the practice lab the log in place this one when you end after you enter username and password and then you click sign in after you click sign in it will be becomes this page is practice lab home page practice lab home page in her session one session two session three session two and session three is uh, teach you how to use the practice lab and some of the information about the uh, how to use the vita information how to use the text layer all the information is here and after that, you see the uh, uh, little bit top, the buttons is called go to practice lab. After you click this button, it will be become this page. And this page, this is the exactly same page of the uh, text layer when you log into your text layer account. And this practice lab, you could be see the year here. And actually, if you uh, log into your practice lab for 2022 tax return, here would be show is 2022. And after you log in, this one is uh, still wide. Uh, it will be an IRS. Because practice lab, they use IRS. But if you log into your own uh, tax layer account, the current user would be your name, your own name here. And this one change year, you would be see the available year here. And this practice lab, everyone, if you want to um, create a new uh, text lay, uh, layer, uh, tax account to help the taxpayer to prepare their tax, you must be click here, start new uh, 2022 tax return and click this button, select. It will be let you to enter the social security card number of uh, the main taxpayer, the pioneer taxpayer. You just enter it, it will be start to making the uh, tax return. But this one, everything will be on the Publication 4012, they will teach you how to use it uh, for details about that. Right now, talking about the uh, practice lab. Okay, this one is the practice lab. Uh, how to use it? Actually, because this is the main things, the major things you would be, uh, 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 actually the function is same on the real tax layer account. So you, when you uh, study for the 6744 uh, publication, you could be using inside the information about the uh, scenario. You could be input those scenario to here. You could find out the answer about the uh, about the standard deduction of the 2022 and those uh, refund, is just possible to see any refund over there. Everything is on our publication. In the publication, you can be practiced in this website. You will see the answer, okay? Okay, next thing, you need to create an account for the certification test. So you need to uh, go back to the link and learn main page 
and then on your left hand side <coughs> you will see username password this part and then you just directly to go down here to create an account if you already have the account you just directly log in if you are not your first time user you just click create account and the next page after you click create account in this page you will be go to the group and click wider volunteer and the second page uh, second question uh normally is click no because you are not planned to become a vital uh, site coordinator <clears throat> are you uh, an instructor mostly is no and then are you irs sp P E C. So you are not. So no. Mostly is no. Except this one. The last uh, last question they ask you is, do you plan to volunteer in Vita program? So this one must be yes because if you don't want to become a volunteer, why you just study and then continue to do a lot of things? So this question must be yes. So training source we're using is four four nine one and setting your first name and last name and first name last name and username password email and your own address everything would be same and daytime telephone this is an option but i suggest you enter it because we this one would be the uh something else we could be contact you guys and then time soon here is los angeles so we're using pacific time and the partner organization name is here is chinatown surface center you enter our uh, center name and the year you have volunteer year you have volunteer actually is one year whatever you registered before or not uh, if you registered before every time you uh start the new certificate you need to add one more year over there so if you are first time to become a uh vital volunteer for example 2023 is your first year so here is click yeah it's click one at least one don't type zero because uh, after the um what uh, after the uh, vital se uh, after the season we will be uh tell irs about those information and then you will be receive a certificate from them okay and here is uh, uh if you don't have the pretend number or c tag number you don't need to fill that you just directly is fill out uh, the last question will be the uh, year of the uh, volunteer so after that you click direct to click register after you click register it would be back to the uh this main page of after you log in and then uh you just click the volunteer standard exam to get exam and take, click the intake interview to get exam if you plan to become a, a basic or advanced you need to pass volunteer standard and the intake in the view and then click basic and the advanced to get the test after you take the test you can print out your certificate and then you could be download the certificate also after that you just uh, click this box to agree with the e-signature of your uh, agreement for the vital volunteer the uh, agreement is called 13615 okay 13615 after you click the after you uh e uh agree to e uh signature for your uh, uh signature and then you just click this one click uh click here you, you click click here click here is uh, to download the uh, your volunteer agreement form thirteen six one four uh, uh no it's thirteen six one five after you click this buttons you can download both of the certificate and the uh, agreement and then email it to me and then I will be help you to create a uh, tax layer account okay so uh, my email is this one is the bottom is a c h e u n g at c s c l a dot o r g okay so 